explore applications of technology and medicine. See how experts prevent, diagnose, and treat today's most traumatic illnesses. Discover the latest breakthroughs in healthcare on World Business Review's Health Journal Television. Welcome to Health Journal Television. I'm Alexander Haig. Digital dentistry is giving many in the industry reason to smile. Joining us with more on this subject is Norbert Ulmer, Marketing and Sales Manager of Lab Products for Serona Dental Systems. Welcome to Health Journal Television. We're delighted to have you, Norbert. Thanks for having me. Good to be here. Good. Now, also joining us is Lee Culp, Certified Dental Technician for the Institute for Oral Art and Design in Bradenton, Florida. Welcome to you as well. We're delighted to have you, Lee. Thank you very much, Al. Now, our industry expert for this subject today is our old friend Christian Sager, Executive Director of the Pankey Institute. Thank you for being here as well. Thank you for having me again. Now, Christian, what exactly is meant by digital dentistry? Uh, it, it, is, it is brought a new term, CAD CAM, if you will. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, what's happened in many parts of other industries is now coming to dentistry, where as opposed to all of the hand fabrications, we're now able to move into the new age uh, of, of the technology. Now, Norbert, what would you say is the most exciting advancement in digital dentistry? If we talk about digital dentistry, uh, I would like to look back into where everything came from. I mean, literally for hundreds and hundreds of years, we've been fabricating dental restorations in a very similar way as jewelry. Uh, teeth have been waxed, they have been uh, invested, they have been waxed out, and then the mold has been cast with metal, often gold. This metal then was being covered up by porcelain to cover the metal-like colors and, and make them look much more lifelike. Um, as you can tell, all these processes were very labor intensive, time consuming, and required an awful lot of expertise. Now with digital dentistry, we can create a tooth within minutes. We can create this tooth over and over again with consistent result and with very, very high aesthetics. Now for more, let's go to this Health General Television field report. This is your tooth. This is your tooth in 3D. Today, dental professionals are using the latest technologies to create lifelike restorations with efficiency and consistency. The restorations that we've done so far with the system is, is over a thousand. We do approximately 50% of all the work in the laboratory on computer now. So with the CEREC in-lab system, we're now able to do things on computer digitally better than we've ever done before. For more than two decades, Lee Culp has been a pioneer in the study and education of tooth anatomy. Serona InLab recently announced the debut of the new Lee Culp Tooth Anatomy Library. The Lee Culp Tooth Library is, has become very popular in that we've taken natural tooth forms that were designed for computer and have allowed technicians and dentists to be able to replicate natural tooth form very easily by picking it out of a library. Currently, more than 300 of these CAD CAM systems have been installed nationwide and counting. As a dentist, we try to uh, restore natural tooth structure with material that looks, acts, and wears like natural teeth, and we're getting very close to doing that with this system. While speed and expense play into the equation of dental restorations, versatility in materials is another major concern. The versatility of the materials is very important because depending on what type of restoration the dentist needs, it's going to require a specific type of material to be used. So having a myriad of materials that we can choose from is very important to be able to fulfill the doctor's needs. For Health Journal Television, I'm Michael Clark reporting. Your turn now, Lee. What kind of financial impact has this CAD CAM technology had on your practice? Well, to, to kind of review what Norbert said, what we do in the laboratory is phenomenally labor intensive. What the computers do and allow us is to do it faster, easier, and with the same type of quality and artistic ability as we've been doing by hand and with a, with a very long training period for our technicians also. So now we can use today's technology to train people faster and easier to do the same type of quality we've been doing for 100 years. 
Very good. Now, Norbert, uh, what is the biggest challenge you face in your industry? Today's lab industry is extremely limited in resources, especially human resources, and there's very fierce competition. Uh, if you look at the, the dental lab market, there's probably 80% of the restorations uh, fabricated by only 20% of the labs. Mm -hmm. And 80% of the labs are probably one to five man labs. They're very, very small size labs. This market is very, very fragmented. Mm -hmm. And it is extremely difficult for those, especially small size labs, to stay competitive. Very good. Now, Lee, uh, as a follow up to Norbert just said, how do you overcome this hurdle? Well, that's, that's exactly why we're here. The, we've, we've developed ways to overcome the hur hurdle by taking technology that's been around in aerospace, automotive, and other industries and applying it to dentistry. Uh, one of the big fears was that we were going to be losing jobs because of it. But CAD-CAM seems to be in a, in a, entering the dental profession at the perfect time as, as fewer and fewer technicians are actually going in. So we're actually experiencing <coughs> a slowdown of people coming in, so we're mm -hmm. allowing the computers to take over what people used to do. Very good. Now, you again, Norbert, what are the key benefits of digital dentistry for dental professionals? Well, Serona has pioneered digital dentistry about 20 years ago. Um, we see it as extremely valuable to dental professional to have clinical results at a very consistent uh, level over and over again. Mm -hmm. And it is especially important because if you look at dentists switching labs today because of anything they are not happy with, it is because of inconsistent results. Mm -hmm. And this is where we can help both the dental lab, the dental professional, and especially the patient. Very good. Norbert, what differentiates uh, your system from the other CAD-CAM systems? The Serona InLab system is probably the most versatile system out there today. Uh, not only just in terms of indication, because the Serona InLab system covers inlays, onlays, crowns, uh, multiple unit bridges, but also in terms of uh, material range. We have more than eight materials on our system, allowing the dental professional to choose the right material in terms of strength and aesthetics for any clinical indication. Well, once again, the clock tells me we're going to have to terminate this extremely interesting subject. But before doing so, I want to thank you, Norbert, for your very fine presentation today. Thanks for having me. I want to thank you, Lee, for your equally impressive presentation. Thank you very much. And as always, we're indebted to you, Christian, for your presentations as well. Thank you. Very enjoyable. And thank you for watching. Until next time, for Health Journal Television, I'm Alexander Haig.